How's it going everybody? Today I'm super excited to be bringing you guys a brand new super super cool deck. Today we're going to be featuring some new cards from Pokemon Celebration and that is going to be Dark Sylveon V and Zacian V. This is going to be the new way to play Psychic decks in my opinion using this big Zacian V Roar of the Sword. During your turn you may search your deck for a Psychic Energy card and attach it to one of your Pokemon then shuffle your deck. If you use this ability your turn ends. So before this card really came out. People were really, really reliant using Psychic decks using Cresselia, hoping to go second so you could attach up to three energy. Um, and then from there, you'd have like an energy advantage. You'd pretty much mitigate the fact that you're going second by getting a ton of energy acceleration onto any any Pokemon you really wish. So you can use Cresselia here, but you can also use the Zacian. So if you go first, you can get your Zacian. You attach, you use a Zacian. Next turn, you already have three energy to use a Storm Sash if you want, or you can even use the Tricky Ribbon. Choose a random card in your opponent's hand. Your opponent reveals that card and shuffles it into the deck. So you can mine your opponent down to four, Tricky Ribbon them down, and then hope that they don't have a supporter. You can also use super cool cards if there's already low on cards, like uh, Oleana. Um, you can discard two cards from your hand, something like Energy you, so that you can get back with Training Court. Um, but your opponent reveals their hand and you can put a trainer like their supporters back in their hand uh, on the sorry uh, Back into the bottom of their deck so you can really really deny your opponents uh, Whole setup with this brand new Sylveon card I think this is a super super cool deck and I would love it if you guys have any at all like ways that you would want to optimize this deck Please let me know in the comments I'm always looking to get better and I love the you know changes you guys like to you know add in the comments But another really cool thing this deck really uh, works well with is Raihan to be able to you know Re-get that energy acceleration back if you get knocked out on something and remember if, if you're using a dark Sylveon And you get knocked out while you're holding a ribbon badge your opponent only takes one prize So this is technically if you want to play the deck correctly um, like a single prize attacker deck um, if you use like all these ribbon badges up until like the last two because you, you, know, you can only use four ribbon badges But yeah, making it so that it really really elongates the game out and just kind of like yada locks your opponent where they're top decking And then once you're top decking and you're the one that's building more energy and you know building more all your resources back up uh, You're the one that's definitely gonna have the advantage of winning like late game situations with this deck So hopefully you like it. We're gonna hop right into it and show uh, a couple games and I haven't, I haven't played them yet So hopefully I win. Hopefully this deck works just as intended. I think it's a really really cool list and, uh, you know, wish me luck. Here we go. Sure, I want to go second with this deck. So let's see if I get to go second. That'd be really nice. No, never lucky. All right, looks like we opened up a Sylveon. It's not bad. Uh, we're going to want to get a Zacian out. And you know, going first isn't the end of the world. Um, we did, we would have liked to have obviously hit a Cresselia so we could have accelerated three energy into our Sylveon immediately. But being able to Fog Crystal for Zacian, hard attach... Um, and then drop a support in next turn is still really nice. So progress drop with a Zacian. Zacian being a psychic type is like really, really, really good. So yeah, we just go like this. Probably just gonna drop this. I don't even need to blow this other fog crystal. I can save that in case I need an energy for next turn. So attach there. And uh yeah. Roar. Right into Sylveon. So we already have enough energy to use this attack next turn. So it's really, really good. Yeah, Tricky Ribbon. It only does 100, right? But it's a little bit of hand control. Like, so next turn when I Marnie them and I drop their hand even even further, it's going to be super, super good at Baki, basically making them dead draw as long as we take out that uh, Altaria they have back there. So let's see. Can we building up an Altaria? Is this a uh, path? All right, so no more no more of that. So we're going to drop the Training Cords to take care of that because we still want to potentially use Ashen later on the game. Leon. They're just going to drop. Oh, so it's Leon Zard. All right. Cool deck. I like Leon Zard. Collect draw a card. So we're gonna be able to kill that thing this turn. That's really, really cool. Let's see if I draw a energy. Uh, it sucks I have to use this fog crystal to grab an energy. I think it's fine. Fog crystal is like such an amazing card. Always grab the hollow energies. Super important. So right here. Training court. Um, you know what? I'm looking at this. I think I am gonna Marnie. I mean they still keep their four. Yeah, actually, did they have a supporter last turn? They weoned. You know what? I'm actually gonna leave them on that. I actually think I'm just gonna research then. Because, like, if they didn't have a support last turn that was worth playing, that means they don't have one, right? So that means I can just kind of start setting up a couple more different things. I don't need to drop this Cresselia, but I think I might in case we get Marnie. Because I want to have this here in case they get the knockout here. I can bring this out to buy me time while I'm re up. So I think we're in a good enough spot here. Uh, let's go. Tricky Ribbon. Yo, let me get that big discard. Survey says, yo, no more Charmeleon. We take those. And we get a prize. You'll have to see that. Cool. An energy. Not bad. What do you got? You're top decking for the most part. You didn't have a good support of last turn because you played a Leon. Did I dead draw you? 
Oh my gosh, I didn't. What if I hit the Altaria? That would have been the sickest play, because now they're going to get a search for a supporter. Um, what? Supporter card. I don't know how they got... Oh, they training corded. All right, that's, that makes sense. So I wonder if they're going to... Hmm, that's weird. Because they... Oh, they just scoop. We win. Yeah, um, they just scoop it up. I, they, I think they misplayed into uh, training courting before Altarian for like a professor's research or like a Marnie. And so they kind of just like felt bad and scooped. But you know what? Our deck worked perfectly. So you yeah, absolutely love to see that. You love to see it. I lost the coin flip. I think going first or second are both good. Like obviously we have to crack a crest here. Oh my gosh, the crest. And we might, we might just go big Zashi in this game. And they're mulling. This is an absolute missing game. We can actually quick ball away for a Sylveon. This is a wonderful hand. We also have two energy switches. It does 30 more damage for each energy, right? So it does 90 to 150. It's just a straight up 150 Storm Slash. That's amazing. That's amazing. And we can load it up right now. They're playing Drizzles with Paths. All right. Okay, that's fine. So we're going to get to Crescent Gazer. I think I'm going to load up the Sylveon. It's probably smarter to load up the Zacian. I'm not going to lie. It's probably smarter to load up the Zacian. We'll see. If they if they have like a lot of bench, like let's see if they crack their Sobbles early. If they crack their Sobbles, maybe we do, maybe we don't. I think it might be better to actually just like load up Zacian. We also have a draw. All right, so the Inteleon. All right, all right. Okay. Yeah, there's a path. That sucks. All right. What is this? Quick ball. So they're gonna get the Sobbles. Pen energy attacking Pokemon in your opponent's hand. So they're they're dead drawing a little bit. Let's see though. They're gonna be able to sob like drizzle next turn, probably. Like they wouldn't have done that if they didn't have a drizzle. So we can training court up. Like we can training court here. Um we can discard this energy. Get it back with the training court. I kinda wanna research. So I actually think I'm gonna attach here. I'm gonna quick ball for the Sylveon. Because I still think we want the Sylveon. One of my Zacians is prized. It's good to know. Yeah, I'm going to research it up. Okay, drop an Orange Guru. Um, yeah, I, I think it's probably just going to be a better idea to load up the Zacian and just like straight load it up. I'm talking like the big load up. Uh, Crescent Glow. One, two, three. It looks like there's three, three left in the deck still too. Cool. That's a lot of energy. We got the big Zacian right now. So, like, our Storm Slash does 150. All right, they're big over here. Yeah, Hydro. It's going to put my energy back, right? That's fine. We don't have a switch yet, but we can hard attach and switch. Oh, man, this is going to be a little bit weird. They're super dead drawing. Let's see. It'd be nice if we could start loading this guy up. I actually might just let them kill that and, like, start loading up the Sylveon. I think that's probably a good play. So energy attach. Um, we're gonna what energy? What card do we want to go back in the deck? Probably a energy here. And then we're just gonna Marnie up. I don't think I need to get a second. Actually, we will probably just do this. Let's get one energy discarded so we can train court it back. And we're actually just gonna grab like a second crest so we have just something to send out in case we have to. I'm running Marnie. Yeah. I know they're at one. I think that Marnie was still the right play. Maybe I should have like researched or something, but I think it's all right. I forgot to training court. Man, I'm misplaying everywhere. Yep, but at least our Sylveon's like good to go now. At least Sylveon's ready to go. Maybe I should have just hard attached more energy here. Because this guy's going to hit the back row, right? 60 damage when your opponent's benched. All right. And he's researching. What a good draw. They're going to take a long time. Maybe I should have researched because I think I gave him like a new fresh hand. Ooh, crushing hammer. Not bad. Let's see if they go after the Sylveon. Heads, never lucky. Oh, they go after Zacian. Okay. Well, I mean, if they KO this thing and I can get my way into a Raihan, well, we can like double attach on a Zacian and that'd be really nice. I think we're actually going to have to just confuse this thing, as weird as that sounds, because this thing's like a big threat. Big backer right now, though. There's the Drizzle. What are you grabbing? Like another Crushing Hammer? If that that's greedy, that means your last card has to be another Supporter. Yeah. Go nuts, my guy. If you want to dead draw yourself that hard, go nuts. Yeah, I'm planning on sending out Sylveon anyways, so... 
Oh my god, never ever lucky. Wow, two crushing hammers. So let's see, I really want to get... Because I'm hitting the Zacian. Alright, alright, that works. Yeah, let's go here. I think you do act... I think we really should confuse. Alright, so there's a rod. We need an energy. We can always get that back with Training Court. Let's, uh, or and Groovy right now. Let's do that before anything else. All right, that's a good card draw. That's a good draw. Such a waste. I don't want to Marnie them. It's fine. Not going to Marnie them. That's a cool card to draw here. I mean, it's a little bit late. Raihan's a little bit late, too. We are going to Disarming Voice. So we just have to we just have to roll the dice right now. I kind of wish that I put the three there, but energy goes back for now. Let's see if we can make it work. Oh my god, I think that was a top deck. Oh, that hurts. That definitely hurts. Good thing is if they only get uh, if they kill the Sylvia, they only get one prize because uh, Ribbon Badge is really really good. Still should work even on Sylvia on V. Evolution Incense, so they're gonna be able to get a drizzle a uh, Sobble drizzle right there. And they're going to be able to... Oh, a Frostmoth. Really? Go nuts. That means you have to have, like, this has to be a Research or a Marnie, right? Show it to me. Whoa, there it is. There's the Research. High five if you have Research. Let's see if they're actually... They might Marnie. We have a full hand. I wouldn't mind Marning this out, to be completely honest. Research. Not bad. Always high five your opponents. Whenever they get up. Whenever they get that plus seven, give them a high five. There it is. So that means Sylveon's, like, discarding effects aren't going to be that optimal here. I wonder if they're going to forget to quick draw. Yeah, Zacian's not really doing that hot. Oh my gosh, more energy hate. You're two for two. Oh my gosh, you're three for... Oh, that freaking just... That actually just, like, really, really messes me up. Like, a lot. That messes me up so much. You're three for three with your crushing hammers, and I still haven't, like, lost the game yet? Like, how am I... How am I this... This okay. I'm gonna start loading that thing up. All right, thank you. Thank you. Needed that. Appreciate you, fam. Okay, that's a decent draw. I need more energy, to be completely honest. I have this Raihan for when they finally KO me, and I don't really want a Marnie yet. I need to get my... Yeah, we have a training court here. Cool. As weird as it sounds, I think I might Zashi in this turn. So, as I think I'm going to actually Zashi in. I'm going to put this here. Because you're still confused. I guess I could Oranguru one of these Marnies. I'm going to put the energy back in the deck, I think. So I have something to Zashi in target correctly. That's a fair play. Yeah, and then I'll Zashian. Yeah. Alright, so who do we want this on? Sylveon's gonna have two energies. Things have only taken 60. It's still at 260. So next time we can attach there. I always wanna have this Zashian like ready to go. Now let's go. Let's see what they got level ball so they're going to be able to get not that much i have another sobble but they have a full bench so it's fine <laughs> telescopic sight yo they're going nuts right now melanie all right i'm gonna draw three that's good to draw use that level ball first then so they don't have to waste their draw and they only have 16 cards left in the deck it's okay for me yeah just keep shooting that zashian buddy If they hit themselves with confusion one more time, that's going to be great. Ugh! Max bullet. So they're going to do a lot to this guy, too. Or they're just going to start, like, sniping snipe the back row. They killed it. All right, all right. Ow. It's all you, bug guy. It's all you, Zashian. All right, so we're going to Raihan here. Oh, 
card? What is the one card that saves us the most here? Because Crest is a... Like, Sylveon's cool. Like, what, what do we actually need? We don't need any more energy. I already have a Sylve... No, I'm gonna... Do I have a Sylveon on the deck? I do have a Sylveon down there. Crest is a weird draw. Bog Crystal's weird. Rotom's weird. doesn't give me anything. Oddies don't give me anything. So, like, I'm just gonna grab my... Do I want an Ordinary Rod to get my Zashin back? Ah, not that. Damn, these are such weird draws. I'm gonna actually just grab this Ribbon Badge and just put it on my Sylveon. Because, like, we have this for this guy if we want it. Put the Ribbon Badge here. Uh, training Court, get my energy back. So what are you at? You're at 240. I have uh, 60, 90, 120, 150, 180. So almost get the KO there. I think it's fine to just start going like this. Let's go. Big deeps. You hit yourself with confusion. I'm in a good spot. But this second Inteleon is big set. I think both our Rhyons are gone. One's out. Oh man, so much energy hate. And this deck's still able to keep up. I think that's absolutely crazy. Are you going to get all four Crushing Hammers? All four. Oh my gosh, they hit all four Crushing Hammers. Yo! Get this guy a lottery ticket. Get this guy a lottery ticket. That's right, hit yourself, Chief. Alright, so you are at 30. How do I get out of this? Is there any way I can generate two energy this turn? At all? I don't think so. I could training court my energy. All right. I should probably go into Crest and just start loading up more energy, but it's too late now. Yeah, I think it's our best shot. It's all we got, guys. It's all we got. We have a decent amount of energy regeneration. It's just that... Oh, I forgot to put my Ribbon Badge on. That's my bad. Like, they can just, like, one-shot me. Almost. Well, now... Actually, they can. They can just one-shot me. Like, strap and strike in there. <sighs> That's a mistake. So I definitely should have Ribbon Badge. Let's see if they take the bait, then. Let's see if they take the bait and just, like, let me get three prizes off of it. They're hard switching. Cool. That works. I don't think that's that big of a deal unless they evolve. Because then they'll shoot 20 here and then they'll just evolve and hit it. I'm going to kill that thing with something. I have, a, I have a boss's orders ready to go. Cool. You can do the damage here. It's fine. Boss's orders out my Sylveon? Oh, hit that? That works. That works. I don't care about that. Thank you. Come again. I feel like I should just ignore that for now. And like come in and just do I want to confuse this or not it's worth 30 I think I might Marnie and take the discard on it so if we Marnie them out their hand is like if they don't have the cards for Sobble they don't have the cards for it you know we can get our uh, guy back right now that's probably the right play so we know we want that there we're gonna old rod back our Zashian oh shit I, I was supposed to press both Crap! I was supposed to get both. No! Let me go back and get both! Fuck, that was a mistake. Crap. I was supposed to go back and get both of them. I was supposed to do all of it. Like, you know, you can do two or both. So, I can choose one or both, and I was supposed to do both. Oh, well. It's alright. Yeah, we're gonna have to Marty here. Um, and then we're gonna drop their hand down by one. And then hopefully we can Marty into something good. Hopefully we Marty them into something bad. I say I still have my ordinary rod, so that's there if I want to get my Zashian back. Let's see. I don't need this crest in my hand. Just to see what we got. Another Sylveon, okay. All 
that's fine dropping that there. Trick ribbon. Let's go. What are we getting? Survey says. Oh, we get the we hit the Italian V Max. Yo, yo, get that back in the deck. Yo, get that out of here. Sylvia big busted out here. Oh my gosh. I don't I don't care. I think that that's so sick. They can still shoot here and hard switch out. They can do all that cool stuff. They only get one prize for it though. I, I literally think that even though we're gonna lose, that was savage. That was so sick. Scoop up now, he's scooping up. Yeah, that's a cool play to scoop that up actually, because then you can evolve there. Yep, that's that's the right play. So we tried the dead drum and we, we got rid of the Intellion. You know they were ready to evolve. You know they're ready to evolve and just won the game. Uh, they could hard switch this guy out and bring this guy back out, and then we don't have anything we can do except for like top deck a Raihan. And even if we do top deck the Raihan, we're still in a bad spot. So, yeah, let's see. Oh, no support? Huh. For Drizzle here. Oh, Italian VMAX. Ah, they had an evolution in sense. I'm so sad. Oh, well. So they're going to be able to scoot this, shoot this guy out. I think there's still one Ryan left in the deck. I, I usually run two in this deck, so. Let's see if they play their cards right. Yeah, if I kill both these, I would win the game, but I don't think they're gonna let me. Yeah, 160 in my front, so they're gonna knock out there. They get one prize there. Yeah, I think the ribbon is still really good. I mean, we gotta go like this. Raihan? Survey says? Not Raihan. Alright, so we got one card to do here. Raihan! Oh, that's a boss's orders. Is that good enough? You have 14 cards? I don't think I can stall enough. Yeah. Oh, it says benched. That, let's just let's just play for stall then. So give me that. Uh, give me that. Yeah, we're gonna play stall, boys and girls. Let's do one of those. Just one. Because we want to be able to train court. So I'll take my energy here. Get my Zashian back. Zashian. We're gonna attach here. And we're gonna boss's order the Frost Moth. Because it requires them to have like a very specific thing here. Roar of the Sword. Cool. Hey, you know what? Can't ask for anything more than this. You can't ask for anything else. We are elongating the game as much as possible. Trying to make a comeback. Maybe we'll deck them. How much energy are in here? <laughs> One. One, two, three. I mean, nine. They probably run about 12. Now, let's see what... The, oh, uh, let's see. That's not the right one. They, they're just going to probably shoot this guy over the next two turns and win the game. So I need to do something to get this Orn Guru gone. I don't think I run any scoop-ups in here. So what do we do? Are we just going to get shot on our Orn Guru to lose? I was just going to search for, like, a switch, probably. That is what it is. Almost, guys. I think we almost had him. We almost had it. I mean, obviously, we get 6 to 2 but a 6 0 but I think it was a, a cool way to play it. If they're not going to win, I'll I'll play the game correctly. Like, draw, draw your deck out, Chief. Let's see if they're sniping the Orn Guru. Is there anything I can do to this Orn Guru? I don't know if I have, like, a scoop up in this deck. Scoop up's not really this deck's style. Just scoop, bro. <laughs> I think I have one more boss's orders, too. No, it's already... That's... Now there's one more boss's order. Yeah, they're going after the Oranguru. Okay. Some Marnie. If we Marnie here, we, we can't KO the Inteleon Bros ever. And if we can't KO that guy, we lose. So we actually have to go for, like, a Primate Wisdom... I think it's better to get rid of the research because there's no scoop up in here. So there's nothing I do against that Orn Guru. Switch was a, a unique draw, but it's not anything that gets us anywhere. 
Um, let's see, there's no more energy left in here either, right? There's, yeah, two horrors, those don't really count. Yes, we just got a Marnie. I don't, I don't see a way that we get out of this, like, at all. There's no, uh, heals or anything either. Yeah. I'm trying to see if, like, we can snipe that guy in the back. But then they just send out something and one-shot our Sylveon, right? It's so, like, we have, a, we have this here. And see, they could always just snipe me right here and get it. That's fine. And we'll see. If we can get another get our way into another boss's order, we might be able to make uh, we might be able to get rid of Centelion. But I think they have enough to just evolve right here and win. Three VMAX Centelions. Yo, this guy is set. Good for him. Shoot the Oranguru, evolve back there, shoot Oranguru. Now we'll see. So they killed one Zacian, one Cress. And like two or three Sylveons to even get here. The fact that we were in like Ribbon Badge, it's like really, really good. You got you got the other Intellion back there? Okay. Alright, we got one more turn, Chiefs. Damn. We didn't get it. We can go for it. Give me bosses orders. Never lucky. Alright, well. Screw you, I'm not I'm getting a prize. You can't stop me. <laughs> That's right, go back in the deck. They had a shady dealing so they didn't have the quick quick shot one. There we go, we got a prize. We take it, and then we lose. But you know what, I think this deck works. I definitely think this deck works. I think it's a cool deck. Um, I think it just goes to show that this deck does have a ton of options. And that you can optimize it. Bro, they're not gonna hit it. I think they're just playing, they're just playing hard to get, Chief. There we go. They won all the prizes. But yeah, uh, we they hit four crushing hammers on us. They use Team Yell. They use that item that puts the, uh, what is it? That puts the energy back. And we still, like, weren't energy screwed. Like, I just want to say that any deck that can, like, hang with that level of RNG energy denial, like, that's going to be a good deck. Like, this card is kind of nuts. And people are going to realize it. So if you can, get your hands on these. This card is going to be good in almost, like, any deck that would run Psychic. Uh... And the fact that it can hit with the psychic energy that you attach to it as well off crest, that's super good. So, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed me playing this deck a little bit. We're probably going to be streaming with it. So if you want to see me stream with this deck live, win some code cards live, think about checking out my Twitch. There's a link to it in the description. And uh, other than that, thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.